Hello, welcome to the second video in my series of videos on computer tips. Today I'll be taking you through how to change the file extension of any file on your computer system. For instance, let's take this file text for cars now. If I go to the properties, you will note that this is a .txt file and then Windows automatically defaults it to be opened with the notepad. Now, one thing about Win Microsoft Windows is this, that once it knows the program that can open the text extension, a particular file extension, it makes it impossible via the normal rename for you to change that file extension for that file. So for us to change the extension of this file, which is from txt to say, I want to change it to .cdr, usually if I, you expect that if I put the .cdr here and click on OK, it should do that, but now let's see. It has added the .cdr, but if I still go back to properties, you will note that it's still seeing the file, the type of file as .txt. It has added the .cdr as just part of this file name. So for me to really change the file type, there's just one sure option, which is I go to the start, I launch my command prompt, then I change directory to the parent folder of where my file is located, then I use the rename function rehen which does the actual file extension renaming for me i type the name of the file i want to rename then what i want to rename it to this time around dot cdr i click on enter then let's go check as you can see it has done that it's now it's changed the extension type if i click on properties you see that my type of file is now dot cdr and windows now doesn't know what we're opening with so but the funny thing is since Windows knows no what program to open this with, it allows me the luxury of changing it to whatever extension I want it to be. Let's say I want to change it back to .txt. Now that that is done, it denies me the, the ability to change it from .txt to CDR via the rename command, the F2 rename option. So the only way I can do this is once again via the Google command prompt. So now you know how to change the file extension of any file on your computer system. Thank you for watching this video.